you are looking at some delicious cookie dough because we have Cookie Jam in the kitchen this morning and here to tell us all about it is Jess and Audrey, the sidekick. <laughs> uh, first of all, what do we got in this bowl here this morning? Well, this is the sort of start of Edna Stabler's oatmeal cookies. Okay. Uh, so we did most of the prep at home right. uh, just to help with distraction. And uh, so we've got... Sorry, pardon me. Go. I was just going to say we've got butter in there that's been softened, brown sugar, vanilla, uh, a beaten egg, some buttermilk, salt, rolled oats, uh, wow. flour, and soda so mm, far. So this is like the base of the cookie. The base of the cookie. And we have a couple of little extras to add on. I will add in. All right. Well, mm -hmm. Do I add the full thing in? Uh, yep. You okay. Just dump them in there. So what is Cookie Jam all about? Maybe just tell us about the event happening. Sure, Cookie Jam is a cookie sale and cookie competition rolled into one. Mm -hmm. uh, it's also a fundraiser from In From the Cold, which is a winter hot meal program at Parkdale United Church. Okay. Uh, and it's happening on October 5th mm -hmm. uh, in the afternoon, Saturday afternoon from 1 until 4. Ah, very nice. So, Audrey, you're going to be tasting the cookies, you said. Yeah. So you can choose to bake them or you can choose to be a taster. So what does a tasting involve? Um, well, for $6, you get to bring home eight cookies. Eight cookies, and you can eat them there or bring them home. That's pretty much it, right? <laughs> yep. So you get to try it all different kinds. Mm -hmm. And now if you're a baker, what does that involve? Well, bakers have to uh, bake 26 cookies and bring them to Cookie Jam. Okay. Two of their cookies will enter into the cookie competition. They can choose from one of six categories. So we have things like um, best chocolate lovers, best gluten-free, best sandwich cookie. Um, and then they are sort of ready to give away the rest of their, their cookies and they get to take home or, as you said, eat there the other eight. I think most of them will get probably eaten at the event. I, I imagine, imagine. <laughs> I imagine there won't be too many to take home. And the nice thing is, is you can try different kinds of cookies, different recipes. All sorts, yeah. Right. How did I do in my stirring here that this looks, morning? That looks pretty good. So what's the next step involved in these oatmeal cookies? So the next thing we need to do is we need to drop them onto the pan. So we do about a teaspoonful. Audrey, do you want to help me with this? Okay. I'll move over to Because you are the sidekick, right? <laughs> so not only do you taste them, you also help out in the kitchen. Is that correct? Yes. All right. So where did you get this idea from? Well, uh, I had a friend, actually, that organized a similar event uh, in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia, in the spring. And I watched it unfold on Twitter and Facebook, and I thought, you know, that sounds like a great event, and the only way for it to happen here in Ottawa is to, to organize one. So I contacted Karen. Uh, and said, would you be willing to franchise your idea here in Ottawa? And she said she'd be happy to. So she actually passed along uh, a little instruction booklet of everything that they'd done. Um, so we had sort of a model to work off of. I love it. Um, and so we just uh, approached Parkdale to see if they would be interested in hosting and then using the event as a fundraiser. And they said mm -hmm. they would be happy to. And I mean, who doesn't like to eat cookies? Basically. <laughs> And so, Audrey, there's a next step involved in here, isn't there? We have to flatten them out with the fork. Mm -hmm. Do we know how we do that part? Yeah, so, so there should be a... There is our little fork over go. here. Do you want to show me how to do it, and I'll try one out? So you dip it in the water. Dip it in the water. And what does so, the water do? So it makes sure nothing sticks. And oh, then that's a good tip. And then you just push it down. Simple enough. And then you bake these in the oven. At what temperature? 350 degrees for mm -hmm. 8 to 10 minutes. Ooh. So Edna, this book, uh, this recipe is from Edna Stabler's book, Food That Really Schmecks. Uh, and <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> she also has a book called Schmecks Appeal. Now you, oh, very interesting. <laughs> now you guys were very nice because you baked me up a full batch mm -hmm. at your home last night that I get to try yes, out. Yes, we get fresh ones. Mm -hmm. Are you going to have them with me? Okay. <laughs> if you must. Nothing eh? like cookies All for right. breakfast. All right, so I'm going to pretend I am the, uh, the judge in this cookie competition and see how these oatmeal cookies did. I think they get a 10. Pretty mm -hmm. good, and they're even moist. <laughs> Perfect. Thanks so much for being on the show this morning. For more information, people can head to the website. Yes. Yep. And it is ottawacookiejam.wordpress.com. So if you want to enter the competition or maybe be a taster and for six bucks get eight cookies, head to the website and all the information is there.